Each February, the nation observes Black History Month by encouraging the study of African American history and celebrating the achievements of African Americans. But how did it happen? Why is it the shortest month? Let's find out. Black History Month was created by historian Carter G. Woodson in 1926. Dr. Woodson was an African American historian, author, educator, journalist, and the founder of the Association for the Study of African American Life and History. He deemed the second week of February to be Negro History Week because it coincided with the birthdays of Abraham Lincoln on February 12th and Frederick Douglass on February 14th. Both dates black communities had celebrated together since the late 19th century, despite the limited blackness of Abraham Lincoln. Too bad these two weren't born in a warmer month. We could have celebrated with cookouts. Okay, back to the story. Over the years, the ensuing popularity of Black History Week led to the occasion stretching throughout the entire month of February, just like that annoying friend who celebrates her birthday all month long. We started that. In 1976, President Gerald Ford officially designated February as Black History Month, urging everyone to seize the opportunity to honor the too often neglected accomplishments of black Americans in every area of endeavor throughout our history. 